What's going on guys? Briar Rabbit here. Rise of Iron is upon us. The Gallahorn is now available. In this video, I'm going to show you quickly how to get this thing. This thing actually isn't that hard to find. It took me about an hour and a half running all the missions, all the parts of the quest solo, uh, and it really wasn't that difficult. So here's how you do it. The first thing you're going to want to do is go and patrol the Plague Lands and find a beacon that looks like this. It doesn't have to be this specific beacon, it just has to have this icon above it. This is going to unlock the patrol mission Locate and Analyze, which is going to bring you to a very specific place. This is an area called Site 6, and in here you will find a spider tank and an axe. Destroy the spider tank as fast as you can, and you will be rewarded with this quest. This is Beauty in Destruction, and it is your first step toward obtaining your Year 3 Rise of Iron Gallahorn. Once you've obtained the quest, simply go talk to Lord Saladin, who sends you to Tyra Karn, who then proceeds to give you this new part of the quest, Beauty in Destruction, which then means we've got some hunting to do. We've got to go find these seven medallions, the first of which is right here in Fellwinter Peak, uh, just to the left of the temple. If you climb the mountainside, uh, you'll find the very first medallion. Remember this path because you'll actually have to go further up here to find a SIVA cluster later on in the quest. But it's uh, a little tricky getting up here. Guardians kind of jump a little funky, especially when they don't have double jump. But it's, uh, it's not too hard to get up here. And you can see that once you are close to it, it is clearly marked. Next, we'll head to the Plague Lands. And again, you'll see that once you get close to these things, they are very clearly marked. The only one I really had trouble finding was in Site 6, but if you actually remember that Site 6 is where you found that spider tank, you'll probably get through it a lot faster than I did. Really, it only took about a half hour to find all of these medallions. Things to remember are your ghost does mark the location on your heads up display, and if you are having a little bit of trouble finding it, use a sniper rifle, look through your scope, kind of look all around with your scope until you see the little icon uh, and then go collect it. Sometimes they're a little bit hidden, but usually they're right out in the open. I'll show the rest of them here so that you can see exactly where they were. Once you've obtained all seven of the medallions, you're simply going to want to go back, see Tyra Karn again, and she'll give you the next step of the quest. This next step is actually pretty interesting. You're going to go to Bannerfall and start putting the artifacts together. Once you head out to the director, you'll see a new mission on your map. It will bring you here to Bannerfall. This wasn't too bad a mission. I actually enjoyed it quite a bit. I did solo it. It wasn't too hard to solo. Uh, it definitely would have been easier with a few people. So if you got a couple of people that can help you out, uh, I would definitely recommend it. But it wasn't too bad soloing it. Basically, it consists of four parts. You got to go walk around Bannerfall, find a bunch of stuff. Uh, then you have to fight off waves of shanks two different times. The two different waves of shanks can be a little tricky because they come at you from a lot of different angles, uh, but it wasn't too bad. And then you got to fight this big ass guy, the Light Stalker here. Uh, once you defeat this guy though, you will get the next step of the quest. Which, of course, is going to bring you right back to Tyra Karn, who is then going to send you back out to the Plague Lands to find some SIVA clusters. SIVA clusters, luckily, aren't that difficult to find. If you're having trouble finding them, though, I'm going to refer you to Reddit. I could show you the ones I found, but you might have already found those ones. That's not going to help you that much. So I'm going to refer you to Reddit. I'll put a link in the description to where all of the SIVA, the known SIVA clusters are so far. I will say this though, if you haven't gotten the one that's at the very tippity top of Fellwinter Peak, definitely go for it. It's a very cool climb. It's a very cool view once you get up there. Once you've collected all of your SIVA clusters, 
You're going to go talk to Lord Saladin once again. This time he's going to give you the last part of your quest. You're actually going to get the Galahorn on this mission. He's going to send you back to Earth for the Beauty in Delivery mission. And this mission is a ton of fun. Once you land, you simply have to fight through some fallen, find this desk that's over here to the left-hand side of your starting area, let your ghost do the work while you defend him from all of the fallen. Lots of fallen come. It's a pretty fun fight, but the reward is huge. And that's it. You've got the Galahorn. After the uh, basically arrival of the Galahorn, you get to play out the rest of the mission. You fight a couple of spider tanks and get to have an awful lot of fun with an awful lot of rockets. Uh, it's a really nice way to finish off the mission. It's a pretty fun quest and it doesn't really take that long. And like I said before, it took me about an hour and a half start to finish. And uh, I did the whole thing solo, so it really wasn't too bad. That's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hit that like button if you liked the video. Hit subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.